guys, I'm Nick, aka the Roy Nick's Games, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to use a green screen with Open Broadcaster software, how to chroma key out the background in OBS. So first off, I'm going to go ahead and create a new scene for this, just uh, just to make it easier for me. So tutorials, what I'll name this, you can use it whatever scene. You also will need to add a global source, so go over here and click global sources, and then click add, and then add your face cam, whatever that is. I'll get into that here in a second, whenever I add the source right here. So I'm going to go add global source and then there's my face cam so add that in now right click on it and properties now once you open up this you want to make sure you have the right webcam chosen which for me is my Logitech HD Pro webcam C920 there's that and you know audio all of that make sure all of that's where it needs to be but this is where we want to focus with this video chroma key so what I would recommend doing is go ahead and hit preview stream and then it's going to open up the webcam hi how you guys doing so now we want to right click on face cam and then go to properties and now we want to focus on the background. I'm actually going to crop out my mouth so you guys can't uh, see it off. It's going to be a little bit off because of how I'm recording this. So um, I know that will annoy a lot of people. So I'm not going to show my, my mouth in this just to uh, you know help your annoyance. But nevertheless, go ahead and hit chroma key. And for me, as you can see, it kind of auto craps out the background. But this isn't even perfect because as you can see, there are some like dots and lines and things like that. But what you want to do is click select here and find a, um, you know, a pattern, if you will, a color that's in between the brightest which I would say is probably, I don't know, right in this area, and the darkest, which is probably right down here or maybe right here. So for me, that's probably going to be right about there. And then as you can see, it's cropped out a little bit of my face there, but that's fine. How to fix that is simply go down here to Similarity or Blend, and you're going to have to play around with these, okay? All three of these, you're going to have to play around with. I can't give you any, any at all. I cannot give you specific settings, as every green screen is different, every lighting environment is different, and so I usually will back off one until I start to see some fuzz right here, or over here, or anywhere for that matter, and then I'll turn it back up until I can make that disappear. And then I'll go back over here to this one and then turn down a little bit until I see some more fuzz. And there we go. Now, as you can see, this is going to work pretty much, but I might want to pick a different color because I don't actually look how, like how this looks. So, you know, I would maybe go in here and be like, okay, if that color's not suiting me, let's go for a maybe a little bit darker color. So right there, that's not going to work. So what if we come in here to this? This might work. Let's see how much we can turn this down. And when we turn that down to about right there, and maybe turn this down just a bit, I think that looks pretty good. As you can see right there, a little bit of fuzziness over there, but we can crop that out. But nevertheless, that's how you can use a webcam or a green screen in uh, OBS, an open broadcaster software. It's not that hard. Just go ahead down here, click chroma key, and click a color that's going to be in between the darkest and lightest colors on your green screen. Whenever you found that color, just simply play around with the, uh, the similarity and blend settings. So, uh, so yeah, that's how you can do that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up. It really does help me out. Um, I have been uh, trying endlessly to get this my green screen to work, and I finally figured out some settings that work for me. Um, it's going to take some time. It's took, taken me like two weeks almost to get my green screen to where I want it to be. So just take some time. Work at it, work at it, work at it. Don't expect it to be perfect. But, uh, but expect that it's going to take some time, it's going to be trial and error, and there's no specific settings I can give you except pick a color that is in between the lightest and darkest on your green screen, and then uh, play around with similarity and blend until it works. Additionally, spill resolution. As you can see, there's fuzz right there on the edges, so if we turn this up to 100, it's going to turn the darks purple, but what it will also do is kind of help the edges over here be less uh, fuzzy. So, nevertheless, guys, that's all I can tell you about a green screen with OBS. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section down below. Again, I cannot give you any specifics as far as what your webcam setting should be because I have no idea and because it's all different. But from your green screen to your lighting, that's what matters. So, um, you know, everyone's is different on this, and I cannot give you any specific settings. So, anyway, guys, I'm Nick's Games. Hope this video helped you out, and I'm out. Peace. Wait, I gave you a thumbs up. You couldn't see it, but peace. And here's some videos you guys might want to go check out. On the left is more open broadcast software tutorials. That is a playlist where you can find every single OBS tutorial I've ever done, ever. So go check out that video if that sounds like something you'd be interested in. It is it is an amazing wealth of just how-to videos on OBS. So go check it out. And on the right is Be Productive on YouTube. How to be more productive when making YouTube videos. And specifically a lot of YouTube videos like I do here on this channel. Also check out my daily Volumes, bombs, and screen. I'm Nick's Games, and I'm out, guys. Peace.